we have, I'm sorry, the Democrat, the Republican, I'm sorry, I get confused. The Democrat and the Green, Colin Bevan. So, um, we have a couple of people here. We're going to ask a few questions. Where the topic is how should we spend our tax dollars? Young lady. We'd like money for schools. Money for schools? That's right. We need money for books. For books. Huh. You, sir, you, what, what, what do you think we should spend our tax dollars on? We need to spend our tax dollars on more drones. We need to spend our tax dollars for the military so we can secure our oil in the Middle East. Uh, very interesting. Okay, so the choice is tax dollars for schools or tax dollars for the military. Mr. Republican. Well, schools, we all know, I think, foster government dependency. I think that kids need to learn young, that they shouldn't depend on handouts. Sir, how, how much money do we need for the military? Oh, I think we could use about $3 billion. I've got 20 here. Oh, that'll do fine. Thank you. Miss Democrat, how should we spend our tax dollars? I think we can make more efficient use of the money we already spend. We don't need to spend more money. We just need better teachers. How much money do you need, sir? Oh, I could use another $4 billion. Here you go. Oh, thank you. That's more than enough. Oh, yes, absolutely. And my name is Colin Bevan. I'm the candidate for Congress in the 8th Congressional District. And let me tell you, we should not be spending more money on military. What? We should be spending more on schools for our future. Let me tell you this. They say in the United States that we don't have money to spend. We have plenty of money to spend. 50% of our federal government goes on the military to fight for oil for the big oil corporations. We'll take that money and we'll give it to schools and educations and invest in the future of the United States. So I hope you'll vote green on November 6. Thank you. So that was the first congressional debate in the 8th Congressional District with all three candidates. And we'll be back shortly with another debate on... Well, let's say that this was the first congressional debate because the real opposition to the Green Party candidates don't want to participate in congressional debates.